hey guys good morning what's going on today i am just gonna be rocking out i got work to do i take you guys on a journey with me yeah but we do have to finish basically my last commission that i have and it's a uh, shout out to my guy hamad who uh is the brainchild of this particular project we're gonna be doing nago from guilty gear peace from scratch that's basically what we're gonna be doing. I'm gonna start the laser work for this project. As, and so I have my cam set up. Let me show you guys. I, there we go, we got the laser cam. We got the laser cam set up. Uh, that's all ready to go. And then I, we gotta print some artwork. We gotta do the whole nine today. So we are gonna be making a Noir fight stick. Uh, layout. If you guys don't know Noir, it's basically the Namco style of controller. Let's get this going. I'm gonna go put some material All right, guys, so we have a piece on the bed. Okay, so you see out here, it's a little to the right. I'm gonna move it over like one tab, just so that there's enough room on each side for it to cut. Okay, that should be good. Yeah, I think we got a healthy amount of space on both sides. All right, so laser is off and going, guys. So um, according to my clock here on the screen, we have about 15 minutes or so. So I'll keep an eye on that. All right, meanwhile, while I do this, I have to start getting the artwork printed out. So we already did the artwork. And again, this is for our boy Hamad. Shout out to Hamad. Hamad is actually from the UAE. Here's the artwork. We did a Nago piece. Super, super, super fun. I'm gonna go prep this uh, sheet right here. You guys enjoy the laser. A few moments later. Okay, laser's still chopping away. <laughs> you guys can see. I have my artwork ready to be printed. Let's go ahead and fire a, a copy off. Okay, you guys are curious what printer I have. I have a Canon Pro 100. That's the top, and then we have the sides. That's the sides, and then we have uh, bottom as well. All right, let's prep this side. So here's the bottom artwork. All right, so that is going to get ready to be printed. Let's go check on our laser. We still have theoretically about 11 minutes. We got a lot going on. All right, meanwhile, while this is going, I'm going to start prepping the parts. I'm going to get the buttons and stuff ready. My printer is also kicking out the print as we speak. It's looking good. I could, I could kind of see it from my peripheral. It's looking really good. We have our artwork already printing. Okay, it looks like sheet one's done, guys. Okay, hold on. Let's get sheet two printing of the artwork. I'm gonna fire away. Okay, it looks like I have every part that I need. I'm pretty sure, yeah. Got my joystick here, got my parts here. Okay, that's looking good. Oh, prints are done. Let's go look at the prints. All right, guys, um, I gotta go swap panels on the laser cam. Okay, you see here, this is how to set up the Glowforge, guys. Um, these are my cuts, okay? So you select your material, I already have it set up. And then these are my cuts. That's the inside cut of the panel, like basically like the, the cutouts, the button cutouts and stuff. And then this is the, uh, the main outline. This is if people want a window cut, but we're not gonna do a window cut today, so I'm gonna hit ignore. I'm gonna select that. I'm gonna hit group, so it's one setting. All right, guys, I am gonna flip the script I gotta hit the button though. How much time we got on this? We got about five more minutes on this. And then check this out. I made, this is the file. This is gonna take forever. This is the file for the, um, for the bottom pads. You see, so this is gonna be engraved in. It, it will be sick. It definitely will be sick. So I'll probably start the build while that's going. All right, it's looking like that piece is done. I'm gonna go up there and uh, start prepping the next piece, guys. All right. Okay, guys, we got the next piece queued up. Back to my glow forge. 
page and we're gonna do the top support for the noir over here guys if you guys are curious this is the you have to choose the material I'm using uh, I use black acrylic instead of clear even though this is a clear panel because it, it just cuts the material better it's like a little hack that we figure out all right so this cut is the uh, inside the button screw holes and then this is the master cut outside okay I gotta go hit go guys okay this shouldn't take that long this should only be like five minutes and then uh, we have to cut out the bottom and then we got to do the artwork and go swap that Am I gonna hit print on this? This is gonna be quick. Oh, I gotta, I gotta hit the button, guys. Laser cam. Guys, this, I need to concentrate on this. This one's like the hardest. This is one of the harder pieces to do right now. You know what? We, we don't need the inner cutout because he's not, we're not, I'm building the stick and we're not doing button inserts. So I don't have to worry about that. That's a good thing. I hit group here. So I'm going to put this roughly in place, but it's not accurate right now. You see how it's not accurate. So I have to use this feature called set focus right here. And this kind of like aligns everything. I'm going to shoot it right there. Now we're gonna cut out the sides. The prints are done, man. Um, they came out great. I mean, everything's right here. You guys saw the process. I'm just going to leave it in a neat pile over here. Okay, yeah, we get to do the engraving. So we're going to do point one, wait, point one six is the thickness of the, of the pad. Oh my God, this is scary, guys. You could barely see, I bet you could barely see it on the screen, but I, I, I could see the, the borders of the pad. It's going to be gut like All right, I'm going to hit print. Let, let, hold on, let's see how long it's going to take. Almost two hours for this. We gotta go, we gotta do it. There's our case. Uh, very nice. Very, very nice. I do have to do a little things to prep for this, guys. So I have to go countersink my holes really quick. We gotta countersink the holes, and we also have to buff down these sides a little bit. So I'll do that. All right, I'm gonna hit you with the laser cam. You guys can watch it while I do the countersinking of the holes. Uh, so we countersunk all the holes, and then um, the next thing I got to do is just uh, unsharpen the edges a little bit. I'm going to do that here. I, it's, I usually do it in the other room too because it's a little messy, but I'll just bring a vacuum. We can barely see any of the engraving yet. It's because it, the, it looks like the tube is in the way, but I mean, we're going to see that. So this is acrylic, right? So when it gets cut, like we just cut it, the edges are a little sharp still. So when I do builds for people, you guys can do this at home if you buy the DIY kit. But when I do builds for people, you know, I want it to be comfortable when they're using it like immediately. So I actually have this system where I use a card scraper. So this is a metal card scraper, right? It's just a, a hard metal steel. It's actually a, a stainless steel um, ca card, I guess. And it's pretty sharp. So I literally just take it along the edge. Let's start on our sides now and get this going. Let's start working on our sides. Okay, so this is the kit. We have the, the button panels. We have the front panel that's gonna be facing like your stomach when you, when you have it on your lap. And then this is obviously the uh, the USB port on the, rear, on the rear end here, okay? Here's the artwork that we cut for the sides, guys.
All right, let's get these buttons in. Oh my God, guys. It's so sexy, man. Oh man, guys, it's becoming real. Oh my god. Ugh. Every once in a while, these come with hex bolts. And I have to get the special thing to get to take them out. Let's go check in our, on our engraving. Okay, so we've mounted the, the Brook Universal Board plus the PlayStation 5 upgrade, okay? Okay, so we're gonna mount the, the lever, guys. And we're using a Sanwa a JLF. All right, I'm gonna flip this over this way. So we got joystick there, guys. I got so excited that I mounted it upside down. All right, now we are properly installed the Le lever. so hard yes let's check on our laser <gasps> oh my god it's it's becoming real guys okay we're gonna do uh the wire portion All right, guys, this is what we got so far. Still got to make it pretty. Oh, my. this is one of the nicest sticks. <gasps> guys, we're a minute away from laser being done. An hour and 40 minutes, guys. This <laughs> is so sick. Oh, my God. Wait till we get the... Can we, can we go get the, um, the foam pads, guys? <sighs> okay, I'm going to go get the foam pads. Wow! The pads, dude. Oh my god. Okay, let's plug it in. Test it out. Let me update the firmware first. Yo, that's a good point. Guess what? We have a custom cable for this. Braided USB-B cable. Red. Very nice, right? So nice. Oh, this feels really good. It feels really good. Okay, guys, this stick is cooked. We have completed the Nago stick. Wow. Oh, man. I'm really proud of this one. This is going to be across the world, guys. It's going to freaking the United Arab Emirates. Can you believe that? This stick is officially blessed. I'm going to do a couple extra things, make sure it works on PS5, test it out. Um, yeah, test it out on PS5, clean it up, pack it up, take some photos. And this is off to the United Arab Emirates. Like, this is not even going to be in this continent. Thanks, man. Yeah, I appreciate you guys tuning in. This is four hours. We did it. We start to start to finish four hours, guys. Four hours. I mean, I mean, to build it. I mean, we had, we had to spend time doing artwork and everything. Four hours. Top notch, right? Look, oh, let's take a look one last time at the... My God, look at the... Look at the engraving. Thank you. Love you guys. Um... If you guys haven't, please follow. Um, please follow me on uh, social media as well. Uh, if you guys want to see like the fruits of my labor, usually I like showcase all this stuff. And also TikTok. Follow me on TikTok. I started being a TikToker.